and welcome to this Tea Break Talk. Today I'm talking with Freya Anderson. Hi Freya, can you tell us about playing netball and what it means to you? Hi, I'm Freya. I've played netball for three and a half years. My team currently is Kingston. I've also played for Leeds Rhinos. I trialled for the Leeds Rhinos in the 13s. I got moved up into the under 15s. And then once I was in that, we all got the opportunity to trial for a comp squad. And I got into that. And that was amazing to me because I was so young and I didn't really have much experience, but I was amazed. Netball means a lot to me because it, it calms your nerves as much as it sounds and you get to meet new people who always love the sport and then you get to be more connected to people. It's just an amazing opportunity and it brings people together. You're very young, aren't you, uh, to be doing all this? Yes. What challenges do you think you face by being so young and doing such a professional sport? It's, I think it's the nerves with being with older people whilst you're playing, because then you think you're not going to be as good as them, but it's never the case because it's not about age, it's about talent and what you achieve. Do you have a proudest moment while you've been playing netball? It was probably getting into the under 13s and then the things that came out of that, like the comp squad, because that will be like the first real thing that I got in netball. Because it wasn't just a county team, it was a pathway. Yeah. That goes into the England netball. So if you could change one thing, like what your aspirations are, what would they be for the future? Would you want to change anything? Um, I'd like to get recognised, like, and the sport to be more recognised because it isn't seen as a much big thing because it isn't really as recognised as, as recognisable as like football or rugby. And they've just started showing it. Is this for it more as a, a a women's sport? You'd like it to be more recognised as a, a women's sport more or you'd like it to be just recognised more as a sport? Yes, and well, both. Because your aspirations, I think you've got huge aspirations and I think you are somebody who a lot of the young people and people on the estate and young girls can look up to and think, I can do that because you're a young girl who's come from an estate that is a deprived area who has achieved mm -hmm. so much and I think that is amazing so for me is there anything you could give another young girl and say what you could say to them it's never about where you come from it's how hard you work